In this video, we'll discuss one of the machine learning indicators that is quite popular among traders. Apart from its user-friendly nature, this machine learning indicator demonstrates fairly good capability in providing buy and sell signals in the market. The machine learning indicator we'll delve into today is logistic regression. The good news is this machine learning indicator can operate on all time frames starting from 1 minute, 5 minutes, 15 minutes, and other time frames. That's why the trading strategy we'll discuss in this video can be utilized for scalping, day trading, or swing trading. Moreover, this trading strategy can also work with all assets such as Forex, Gold, Cryptocurrencies, and other assets. Therefore, make sure you stick around till the end of this video, and don't forget to support us by liking and subscribing to this channel. In this example, we will use the logistic regression machine learning indicator with a 15-minute scalping method. To utilize this trading strategy, you can enter trading view, then go to the indicator search tab. In the indicator search tab, type machine learning logistic regression and simply select machine learning logistic regression from Capizo. After that, go to the settings tab of the logistic regression machine learning indicator. You can adjust many aspects in this indicator settings tab. Some of them include the lookback window. If you change the number in the lookback window, the indicator will give signals based on the number you input. However, if you want to change it, the minimum number that can be used is 2 and above. Then you can also change the number in the normalization lookback. If you change this number, the signals provided by the indicator will also change according to the number you input. Like the lookback window, the numbers you input here are from 2 to 240. You can also change the numbers in other parts of this indicator. However, in this example, we will only change the settings in the signal filter section. In this section, there are several options you can choose from. For example, you can choose to calculate the indicator based on volatility or volume. In this example, we will use the option in the both section. If you choose the both section, the signals will be filtered based on market volatility and volume. Then click OK to confirm the changes. As you can see, these are the signals from the indicator based on the settings we have applied. A blue arrow indicates a buy signal, while a red arrow indicates a sell signal. And as a trend filter in the market, you can also add one more indicator. Go to the indicator search tab and type extreme trend. Then simply select extreme trend from Cacro stocks. After that, enter the settings of the extreme trend indicator. In the style tab, deactivate the shape option, then change the color of the EMA 200 according to your preference. In this example, I will use white for the EMA 200. Then click OK to confirm the changes. The white line represents the EMA 200. The blue line indicates the bullish trend line. Meanwhile, if this trend line is yellow, it indicates a bearish trend position. If this trend line is blue and above the EMA 200, it signals a bullish trend, and your main focus should be on finding the best points to place buy orders. Conversely, if this trend line is yellow and below the EMA 200, it indicates a bearish trend, and your main focus should be on finding the best points to place sell orders. Now, let's discuss how to place buy and sell orders using this indicator. Placing a buy order. If this trend line is blue and above the EMA 200, it indicates a bullish trend. In this position, your focus is to find the best point to place a buy order. Wait for a buy signal to appear from the logistic regression machine learning indicator. Once the buy signal appears, ensure that the formed candlestick is bullish. If all conditions are met, you can place a buy order after the bullish candlestick is closed. Place a stop loss below the buy signal arrow. Use a target take profit with a risk and reward ratio of 1 to 1.5. Placing a sell order. If this trend line is yellow and below the EMA 200, it indicates a bearish trend. In this position, your focus is to find the best point to place a sell order. Wait for a sell signal to appear from the logistic regression machine learning indicator. Once the sell signal appears, ensure that the formed candlestick is bearish. If all conditions are met, you can place a sell order after the bearish candlestick is closed. Place a stop loss above the sell signal arrow. Use a target take profit with a risk and reward ratio of 1 to 